This is an NPC that we use in every game we made. Since we create Survive Cookie Run in Area 51, Ginger Brave Edition. And this is how we put the cookie image on the humanoid figure. We put the image on the NPC's torso. Stretch the torso to fit the image size, make the humanoid invisible, and don't forget to add the back. And done. The Survive April Fool's Cookie Run have a different NPC, the same as Nextbot. We only put an image inside the model, place the picture on the image, and it will appear on the model. Don't forget to enable the face camera option in the image explorer. Because the image focuses on your screen, the NPC is going to look like an actual next box. Developer Jonathan Ginger was banned for uploading an image of Micmac in the game because Roblox Moderation believed that Micmac was a minor, even though he is not. Jonathan is trying to contact support, but he has not received any tickets in his Gmail. So he decided to draw Micmac as a cookie run version. After he was unbanned, he uploaded the art he drew, and it was approved by the moderators. Before Jonathan uploaded an original Micmac image in the game, the icon was approved by the moderators. However, he received a warning regarding the image because it included Micmac. Consequently, Jonathan contacted the Roblox support team and received a message stating that they had mistakenly removed the image. After the third upload, the moderators approved the icon. Jonathan Ginger has created seven Cookie Run fandom games on Roblox. It takes a long time for Jonathan to update the seven games he created because he is the only game developer who made them. He received requests from his fans to create these games, and as a result, he is solely responsible for maintaining and updating them.